fossil fuels, forums, and fires. Hey, I'm Jacinta, a production assistant here at Waroni, and this is Waroni's weekly wrap up for week eight. In a student forum held on Wednesday, members of the university executive answered questions regarding the current financial status of the AU. Several of the questions focused on the university's continued investment in the fossil fuel industry, with some criticising the university's lack of action. In response to these concerns, the ANU's Chief Operating Officer, Paul Daldig, announced that the university will release a full report on the social responsibility of its investments in the next few weeks, pending approval by the ANU Council. The ANU campus saw dramatic scenes early Friday morning, with a demountable building in flames. The blaze was quickly brought under control by ACT Fire and Rescue, and fortunately no one was injured. It is unclear how the fire started. And lastly for this week, ANU Professor Lisa Curley has been appointed as a foreign member for the US National Academy of Sciences. Dr Curley was recognised for her distinguished and continuing achievements in original research, for which she was awarded the prestigious James Craig Watson Medal in 2020. Professor Curley is also an advocate for greater gender equality within astronomy, noting that while astronomers have led the pack in equity initiatives, programs are not working fast enough. Ugh. That's all for this week, guys. Have a good one. <laughs> <laughs>